Hope Worldwide is an international charity that changes lives by harnessing the compassion and commitment of dedicated staff and volunteers to deliver sustainable, high-impact, community-based services to the poor and needy. Why is with the Dunbar, Mead, and Duckery Elementary Schools, and we're in Dunbar right now. Okay. Um, we've put together a nice fitness room for the kids. We're still getting equipment in. It's still growing. This is the first year we're doing this, so it's really, it's really going to keep growing over the years. We run an after-school program, a Saturday Academy. Those are also growing. Kids keep want, asking for permission forms and want to come in as their friends talk about how great it is. We run the recess inside. Um, we've also started a step team. activities just to stay healthy, lead healthy lives, sure. learn teamwork, and learn discipline. So it's, it's an excellent program. I think this program has been fantastic for getting our children ready to live healthier lives and it could benefit children everywhere. Primarily what we're doing here in these schools is we are trying to affect the um, adverse conditions in regards to the childhood obesity epidemic and we um, create um, options for the children to become physically active and so primarily we want to um, increase their overall health which will um, positively affect their academic performance as well as their overall quality of life in the future. Oh, Here at our school it's been a positive impact because kids are now actively engaged. They have something to do. Well the Hope Worldwide program is really a learning experience. We learn new, diff new things and we play games and exercise a lot. Many of the physical fitness education classes have been reduced across the district um, throughout the United States and this excellent supplement uh, gives our children an opportunity to um, participate in physical activity and to learn lifelong um, physical fitness skills, especially our young women. Every kid's different, but every kid still has the same needs. They still need to be active. Kids don't like to sit still for long periods of time. And they really respond to it. They, they love what we're doing, and the interaction has just grown so much. At the first, you know, they were cautious, they didn't know who we were, but we've really gotten a good rapport with the kids. This young brother right here, Rob, this is my dude right here, worked so hard, you know, from the time I got here until now. A hard-working young man, talk to him about how this program has helped you, dude. <laughs> That's good stuff. Well, it's with Hope Worldwide, they bring students together, so we all just have activities and stuff, exercise a lot, and be ourselves. options for the children to become physically active and so primarily we want to um, increase their overall health which will um, positively affect their academic performance as well as their overall quality of life in the future. <laughs> Alright quick question I want you guys to name the organs that are in your body. Yes. Your heart? Your heart. Very good. Hearty heart. Yes. Your um, um, liver? Your liver. Yes. Your brain, all of those things, yes? Okay. Your bones. Uh, we are a nation of couch potatoes, unfortunately, and, and helping children and families understand the importance of, of fitness, especially in our African American Latino communities. I didn't used to eat that much fruit and stuff. When uh, when Trisha and I'm like, why are you not eating? Because I don't have an appetite. And they like, they just like, put me. me Make me eat some fruit and stuff, and I started eating fruit a lot. And I started exercising better. 
and it's really exciting. There's little puppets that we have and you pull out the organs and it's like Hardy Heart and Wendy the Lungs and it really teaches them about their body and how to eat right and how to prevent um, diseases in the future. Um, I think there's been a huge impact, um, not only characteristically, once the children understand the importance of being healthy, eating right, making some responsible decisions. Um, I think it changes um, their focus and the way that they learn and the reason why they want to succeed.